What's going on gamers? Today we're going to be going over the error that says you have been kicked by an operator. So I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate the error for you. You just jump into multiplayer and then here's a server that we want to head into. But when I click play, it says server whispers to you, you don't have access. And then you'll get kicked by an operator, which you're not actually getting kicked. The server is just kicking you because you don't have any roles on the server. So let's go ahead and fix it. To fix this error, you're going to want to head to game panel and then stop the server. This should be your first step when you're changing any of your server files. Once the server stopped, go ahead and click on the players tab on the left up here. From there, you're going to go ahead and want to scroll to the username. The user for this example is lit the worst. So we're going to go ahead and click on that user. As you can see here, the role has somehow been set to none. You're going to want to go ahead and click that and then set it to whatever you want to set it to. I'm going to go ahead and set it to default role and then hit save. From there, you're going to want to check if there's any other player dependencies. So if we scroll down, you can see that there's a player listing for that user again, and it's also set to none. So what we're going to do is go ahead and click on default role and then hit save. Now head back to the main page of your server by clicking the name at the top here and restart your server. Once the server's back up, the player should be able to join in. And as you can see here, when I head into multiplayer, head to the server, I log in just fine the way that I'm supposed to log in. Another reason that a player may not be able to join is because you've accidentally banned them. So even when you head into players and you go to the player and you change the role as we did before and you hit save and you join the server, the player still may not be able to join in. So another thing that you might want to check is if they're banned. Make sure if that is set to true, go ahead and change it to false and then hit save. Well, folks, that's all I've got for you today. Thank you for using an Apex server. Thank you for watching this tutorial. And as always, I hope you have lots of fun.